okay class so now we are going to discuss about the sources of food so as you can see in the picture there are two main sources of food number one is plant and number two is animal so first of all we are going to describe about plants we are going to understand what are the parts of the plants that are edible for humans so class the first point that you can see under the plants that that is roots so there are certain roots that human eats which are edible and which give us a lot of energy they are highly rich in carbohydrates mainly so some of the examples of these edible roots are given here for example as we can see number one is sweet potato then we have turnip then we have beet so class our next point is stem number two point stem so here we can see the main example given is potato onion bamboo mainly the shoot portion not the leaves one in the stem that we can see potato which is a modified stem which is a tuber mainly it is a modified portion of a stem and then onion is also a modified portion of the stem but bamboo is the normal one and generally the bamboo which is edible is the younger bamboo which is of not more than of one feet in height so class the next point that we have the third point is leaves and here the examples given are number one spinach number two coriander number three mint as we all are familiar with these three leaves that are edible and that are good for health also so class next is our flowers so there are some edible flowers that we eat for example the pumpkin flower if you remember in the chapter we deep fry this flower along with uh, other paste that we make from different things for example like rice flour or basin then we have the second example that is our banana flower which is also quite famous in all of the portion of our india so class our next point fifth point that is seeds for example there are many seeds which are eaten and most of them we take it as our staple for example rice rice is a staple food in most of the states of our country and then we have wheat which is also a staple food and we take it as roti or chapati and then we have all the pulses under the seed that is you can say the example that is given here moong dal and we can also consider chana dal and there are many kinds of different kind of dals are also available so class here we come to the last point of the plants that is six which is fruits and we all know there are plenty of examples of fruits for example if we go for mango apple orange etc etc there are many more now class we are going to move to the second type of the resources of food that is the animals and from animals there are not as much as variety that we have from plants we have some limited variety of food that we get from the animals so the first thing class that we get from the animals as pointed down in the picture here number one that is dairy products and dairy products mainly contain everything that is made of milk for example if we say yogurt which is also known as dahi then we have cheese we have paneer then we have many items made out of milk all come under this dairy products and the dairy products are mainly uh, produced by cows buffaloes goats etc in regions like rajasthan people also use the milk of camel to make the dairy products so class moving to the next point that is point number 2 meat and we get meat from chicken goat duck class meat is a very valuable source of protein for humans it gives us a lot of protein that's why we include meat in our diet okay class so moving to the next point that is point number 3 egg we have the example from where we get egg that is number 1 as we can see in the picture it is hen then we have duck then we have geese and we also know that the largest egg that is eaten by human belongs to the ostrich so class the last point under the animals that we have is honey and which is mostly obtained by only one animal which is an insect known as honey bee honey bee collects all the nectar 
and then they collect it in their beehive and from the beehive we extract all the honey for our food that's all for today's class thank you class